In the heart of a sun-drenched meadow, where wildflowers swayed in the gentle breeze, there dwelled a rabbit named Benny. Benny was no ordinary bunny, he was known far and wide for his bravery and kindness. His days were filled with hopping through fields, munching on crisp greens, and spreading joy wherever he went. One fine morning, as Benny was enjoying the warmth of the sun on his fluffy fur, his friend Timmy the turtle approached him, excitement gleaming in his eyes. Clutched in Timmy's slow-moving claws was a shiny pebble, polished to perfection by the flowing stream nearby. Look what I found, Benny! Timmy exclaimed, his voice filled with childlike wonder. Before Benny could respond, a mischievous squirrel named Sammy leaped out from behind a bush, eyes fixed greedily on the glimmering pebble. That's mine! Sammy declared, snatching the pebble from Timmy's grasp. With a sly grin, he pushed Timmy aside, chuckling at his slow pace. Slowpoke! Timmy stumbled backward, his shell scraping against the ground, his eyes brimming with hurt and confusion. He had never encountered such unkindness before and didn't know how to react. But Benny, ever the vigilant friend, wasted no time. With a determined flick of his cotton tail, he hopped over to where Timmy lay, his ears perked up with resolve. Stop right there, Sammy. Benny commanded, his voice firm and unwavering. Sammy, taken aback by Benny's sudden intervention, paused in his tracks, his bushy tail twitching nervously. Why should I listen to you, Benny? He challenged, his voice tinged with defiance. But Benny stood his ground, his emerald eyes blazing with conviction. Because bullying is wrong, he declared, his words ringing out across the meadow. We should all treat each other with kindness and respect. That's what friends do. Sammy's bravado faltered, replaced by a sense of shame and remorse. He hadn't realized the impact of his actions until now. With a sheepish expression, he turned to Timmy, who looked up at him with hopeful eyes. I'm sorry, Timmy, Sammy mumbled, his voice barely above a whisper. I didn't mean to hurt you. Timmy's face lit up with a radiant smile, his heart swelling with forgiveness. It's okay, Sammy, he replied, his voice filled with warmth. Everyone makes mistakes. What matters is that we learn from them. And with that, the three friends came together in a warm embrace, their differences forgotten in the glow of newfound understanding. They spent the rest of the day playing in the meadow, their laughter echoing through the trees, their bonds stronger than ever before. As the sun began to dip below the horizon, casting golden hues across the sky, a wise narrator's voice filled the air, echoing the sentiments of friendship and courage that had unfolded throughout the day. Remember, standing up to bullies is not only brave, but it also paves the way for a kinder and happier world, the narrator proclaimed, his words carrying the weight of truth. And as Benny waved goodbye to the camera, his heart brimming with pride, he left behind a legacy of bravery and compassion for all who watched. For in the meadow of life, it was Benny the brave bunny who stood tall, a shining example of what it truly means to be courageous and kind.